how I love me some debt-free Friday. But first, if this is your first time watching me, hello, welcome to my channel. My name is Gia, and I have a series here on my channel called Debt-Free Friday, where we talk about budgeting, getting out of debt, making better financial decisions, making more money, all of the above. I would love for you to join my YouTube family by clicking the subscribe button down below, as well as the little bell next to it. And for those already subscribed, welcome back. So today on Debt Free Friday, we're gonna be talking about more ways we can bring in more money for our families, making extra cash at home, changing careers, all of that stuff, all in the comfort of your own home. Because honestly, making more money is something that can help us financially if we have the right mindset. Because I do want you to know that just because you make more money does not solve your problems. So if you can't handle budgeting and spending the correct amount of money with the current money you have, it's only gonna get worse if you make more money. Okay, so let's, so make sure that, you know, you're working on um, intentional spending, not overspending, not engaging in retail therapy because all of that stuff can be detrimental to your finances in the long run. Okay, I have tons and tons of videos on my channel here discussing how to create a budget, how to stay on a budget. You can start by downloading my free zero-based budget template in the description box um, that will help you to, you know, just get on the right path, okay? And I have, lot, like I said, I have lots of different videos on my channel all about it. You can tap this eye right here to start watching the playlist. But again, today we're talking about bringing in extra cash, working from home, either full-time or part-time, what you can do to get yourself in a better financial position because if you have, if you've been doing your budgeting and you, you got your plan to get yourself out of debt and you've cut your expenses, expenses as much as you can, at that point, it's time to work on trying to make some extra money. Work from home jobs have become more and more and more popular over the years. According to flexjobs.com, it has increased in popularity by over 115%. Yes. And a remote job survey said that, and as of 2017, 43% of US Americans work remotely either part-time or full-time. So that number is only increasing as technology becomes better and as we educate ourselves more and are more open to more flexible hours and just arrangements in the workplace and the work environment, those numbers are only gonna increase as time goes on. Okay, so that's something to keep in mind here. So let's jump right into the, to the 10 jobs that you can do to make some extra cash. Number one, social, social media manager. Okay, so a social media manager is someone who manages all the social media for certain brands or certain accounts or influencers. So it's hard to be active on every single social media site there is from Pinterest to Twitter, Snapchat, Instagram, YouTube. I mean, it's hard to be active and popular on all of those platforms. So what brands do is they hire people to create posts and content for them to upload on their behalf on all of their social media platforms. So if you're someone who's into social media, who likes to uh, grow social media and create content in that environment, then that's something that you can definitely exceed in. And according to indeed.com, social media managers can make on the upwards of 49 to $50,000 a year. So that's amazing. And you can just search for di on different um, job, look, job searching platforms. You can search for social media manager and see what pops up for your area. So the next couple are my absolute favorite, especially if you are a stay-at-home mom who had who previously had a career or wants to make some extra money or make money for their family. These next three that I'm gonna talk about are perfect because it's so flexible. So these next three that I'm gonna talk about will definitely pay off if you put the hard work in. The next one is becoming a virtual assistant. This would be perfect for any moms that um, still want to kind of do something else besides, of course, taking care of your kids and your family because that's enough work in and of itself. But this is an excellent way with, with flexible um, hours and availability. So my friend Lydia over at Lydia Sen, her YouTube channel Lydia Sen created a course called Becoming a Virtual Assistant because she's had so much success 
in her um, career as a virtual assistant. So now she's teaching other moms how she's able to do it because she homeschools her kids. She takes care of her family, homeschool her kids, and she was a virtual assistant on the side and she was able to make a full-time income. And now she's sharing how to do that for yourself, pretty much creating your own virtual assistant business, how to get clients, how to get paid, how, how much you should charge them, all of that. I mean, it is such a great course that she has. The link for that course is in the description box um, and she's offering all of my subscribers $5 off if you use the coupon code GIA. I have taken the course myself and Lydia really knows what she's talking about so if that's something that interests you, you're good at organizing and you're good at time management, I think that that would be perfect for you. So check that out. The link is in the description box to become a virtual assistant. So the third thing that we're going to talk about is blogging. Now, before you roll your eyes and say, oh my gosh, yeah, yeah, right, it's, it's too hard, it's oversaturated, I'm here to tell you, girl, that listen, blogging can make you some extra money, especially if you're not comfortable in front of the camera and that's not just something that you wanna do, but you still want to try and um, make some extra money on the side and put in as much effort as you, you feel like, then blogging is the way to go, okay? Because you, if even if you wanna just test the waters to see if it's something that you like, I think um, it would be really beneficial. So Susie from Start A Mom Blog, we recently did a collaboration video where she talked about how she makes pretty much 20 to 30 thousand dollars a month from her blog and she teaches other moms how to create mom blogs okay and so I know not all of you guys are moms but even if you're not a mom and you want to make some sort of blog then Susie is the teacher to to go to I mean she really really knows what she's talking about you can tap this eye right here to watch our collaboration video or you could click the link in the description box to sign up for her free blogging course so that's wonderful so the other thing that I'm going to talk about that I, I think are perfect for moms is YouTube okay first of all before you just start screaming Gia stop it okay YouTube it takes forever to make money and it's just so oversaturated you know you may be right a little bit with that but I do think that there's enough room for everybody to win on YouTube and I recently just launched my course called Analyze Your Analytics which teaches you how to really dig into your analytics to make your channel grow. So if you have a YouTube channel already and you're really wanting to get into the YouTube partner program so that you can monetize your channel and you're really wanting to really make it grow because um, in order to get in the partner program you, you have to have like a thousand subscribers and a thousand hours of watch time then you definitely want to look into learning how to analyze your analytics. The link for that is in the description box as well. Number five, transcriptionist or a transcriber. I think this is something that is going, the need for this is going to not just increase, increase, increase over the years. And basically what a transcriptionist does is they listen to audio files and then they type what they hear. According to ZipRecruiter, transcriptionists can make around $59,000 a year and I had no idea it was that high. So you can definitely look into websites like quicktate.com, transcribeme.com, or transcribeanywhere.com to see, or you can sign up for all three to see, um, you know, what you need to do to get started. And that's something that, that would be great for someone who maybe had some administrative experience, who's really good at typing, and <clears throat> who doesn't mind listening and listens very well. So um, you definitely might wanna look into that if that interests you. Number six is a website tester. So basically all a website tester needs to do is to go on different websites and test to see if the links work, if the clicks work, if you click somewhere, does it give you the information that you need? Are the pop-ups working? All of that for different websites. They can make anywhere from $10 a test and then the best strategy is to sign up for multiple companies that find all the bigger companies for you to test the websites on. So you, you would wanna sign up for usertesting.com, youreye.com, and userlytics.com. All the links for these websites are in the description box in case that's something that you wanna do. That's something really easy that anybody can do. And again, that's making extra cash for you and your family. Number seven is to become a travel agent. So um, a virtual travel agent at that. According to indeed.com, virtual travel agents can make anywhere from $12.50 to $50 an hour, okay, planning trips. For people which is amazing especially if you like to travel and you're really into um planning um vacations this would be perfect for you all you need to do is like go to indeed.com and search remote travel agent and see what pops up for your area um you'd be you'd be surprised so um if that's something that interests you you should definitely check it out number eight 
customer service representative. So if you have um, a customer service background, then you can definitely work remote. Don't feel like you have to work into in a call center in order be, to be a customer service representative. So many companies from Hilton to 1-800-Flowers, they all, most of their customer service reps work remotely. So that's, um, it's cheaper for companies that way and it's better for you as, as the worker so you don't have to go into work every day and you know you have that flexibility that you need they pay anywhere from nine dollars to twenty dollars an hour and you can look at sites like arise.com vipdesk.com or liveops.com um, if you're interested in that number nine search engine evaluator now this is someone who um, tests sites like Google or Yahoo and you put in a search and see if your results that pop up are what you need and it's it, it they are relatable according to glassdoor.com you can make anywhere from $13 an hour you might want to check out a website called leapforce.com and you can find informa more information on that number nine you can become an online tutor and online tutors can make anywhere from 14 to 25 dollars an hour literally teaching online so i know as a parent i would definitely invest in a tutor for my child especially if it was like remote and you can just do it through your computer or your phones instead of having someone like come to your house all the time that would be so wonderful and you can look at sites like um tutoring.sylvanlearning.com tutor.com or tutorvista.com um, or even like you can put an ad on Craigslist, you know, cause I think I would look on Craig Craigslist as, as long as the person's credentials were, um, you know, valid for a good tutor. You know, you can kind of market your own self that way or word of mouth is huge, especially if you can get in good with like certain um, sports teams or a group of moms um, and word of mouth will spread quickly for you. And so if you have like a teaching background or if you have a degree in a certain like mathematics or something and you just wanna make some extra money and make your own hours, then this would be perfect for you. And the last one I have today is to become a telephone nurse. Now, according to Reg registerednurse.org remote nurses make around seventy thousand dollars a year so that's amazing all healthcare companies hire remote nurses nurses remotely um, health management companies hire them because people can call your healthcare provider in order to talk to a nurse and so this would be great and you'd have your on-call hours you'd still be at home and you can do what you have to do in the in the comfort of your own home so if you have a nursing background and say you you left nursing to take care of your babies this may be a, a good option for you um, to do on the side or even full time to in order to make some extra money for your family you can check out medicaljobsonline.com or judge.com to find uh, positions for remote nurses. So I think I give you guys 11 jobs and 11 ways for you to make some extra cash full-time or part-time from home. Leave a comment down below and let me know, are you going to take action on any, any of these? Okay, so if the Lord is putting something on your heart for you to change your career, if you hate your job, if you are just, if you dread going into work every day, trust me, girl, I've been there, okay? Take action. You have the power to change the trajectory of your life, so take action on these. If anything speaks to you or feels like it would bring you some joy, girl, con Marie this. Okay, and take action on it and you know, see what works out for you because you never know what the Lord has in store. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you haven't hit that subscribe button yet, you can tap my picture up above and you can also check out my previous video right over here and all of my social media platforms all listed down below. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.